is uh, Brian Heater from Gearlog. We're here with Arthur Wong of uh, Hi Mini, and he's going to demonstrate. His, it's a wind power and solar powered charger. Yep. Uh, so basically, we have this very portable handheld uh, wind turbine, but it's able to. It has a DC input hole, allow you to uh, plug in with solar panels. And then what's interesting about, you see the red light is going, so that means it's charging. Mm -hmm. So what's interesting about these solar panels, and they're also length. They're actually 0.7 watt, about close to a watt of electricity. And from the beginning, our company believes that, you know, green power has to be active. You got to show people it has to be active. Mm -hmm. You're actively showing people it turns green. So when the turbine turns fast enough, enough voltage, it, the turbine turns green. So there's a the green lights in there. So you actually see the, you see the, mm -hmm. um, so uh, as you're having fun and you're a uh, healthy lifestyle, you're riding, for example, when I ride bike to work, I clip on high mini and then I have 30 minutes of commuting time. And then when I go to the office, I take out my solar panel, I lay out my desk. Mm -hmm. and, and then from that, I go home and then I, and then I charge my cell phone and MP3 and uh, my PDA with it. At the end, after I, yes, I do cheat it sometimes. And like, you know, once a week, depends on the weather. If the weather is really sunny and then like I get lots of wind, I actually only have to plug into the wall maybe once or twice a week. But, you know, it really depends on the weather. But the fact is when you go on the slope, when you go snowboarding, mm -hmm. you can actually clip this on and then you okay. come down the slope and people actually see what you're doing. You're actively charging. Green. How much how much charge are we talking about? If if you if you take that, that thirty minute bike ride to work, like how, how much how much talk time are you gonna get on the phone? For example, twenty minutes of talk time, uh, twenty minutes of bicycle riding, you actually get around forty minutes to thirty minutes of iPod playtime. That, I mean, yeah. to, to most people, it's only a couple million watts. And to most people, that doesn't count much, yeah. uh, how much electricity you generate. But it, it does make a difference. And at least, especially when you plug into the, you reduces the time you plug into the main. Uh, or, for example, because this charger, uh, it's, it's a portable charger. So you take your charger with you. The fact that you're taking your charger with you, you're actually unplugging the adapter from the main. Once you unplug, it actually saves you so much electricity already. So our idea is, this is a charger that actually upgrade existing chargers uh, with your cell phones and all your cell phones because it's, it has it's a, a supplement. Yeah, this is a yeah. supplement. Yeah, but at the same time, it has a real function as a real charger. You can fully charge your phone, and it has a universal adaptive output uh, between 200 to 850. So you can charge very low power training devices and high power training devices. It's adaptive output, so it wouldn't damage your product. For example, um, most of our product out there in the market is pushing at a certain current, a certain voltage. And ours is actually has a range of flexibility to that. And so it's quite interesting that we're even we're trying to adapt to the existing system. We're not trying to reinvent the whole wheel. 